All right, I've got this red Naga hide that's going to be our new seat for the Model A. There's the old seat, um, as we've seen before. It's been a few days since I was on here, so pardon the break here. But uh, I've marked this on the back with some lines that I'm hoping to put some stitches in. I've practiced this um, with a scrap and things I cut out so that I'm going to try to do something like this so I can get, I can't work with one hand, here we go, so I get these seams stitched into it to create the shape, this is so dirty, I hate opening it, but to get the cushions, the individual lines, that'll just make it look more like it's supposed to, a little more professional looking, if I can sew a straight line. So I'm going to follow the line um, and stitch these up like this. Put a put a like an eighth of an inch fold on the back of it with it stitched, so that we get this look on the front. I just got my red thread, so I can um, they'll show a little less, and maybe I can make my stitches a little tighter and make it all come out good. So. That's the plan. Let's see what happens. I think you might be able to see my face here. I'm not sure. Um, here goes nothing when it comes to uh, sewing. This is my first attempt for the real deal. I've done a little bit of practicing, trying to get used to this machine, um, trying to learn a machine, trying to learn how to sew. It's been a long time since I took any kind of sewing class. But uh, here we go. See what this does. I put these clippy things on here to help me keep it in line. Then I'll get hung up along the way here. We'll see how it works. Um, yeah, okay, so there we go. Nice and easy. Hang on. I can't do two things at once. ever sewn before is probably laughing at me. Speed this up when I play the video and it'll look better. Oh, I forgot to do something at the beginning. Did you catch that? I didn't do a back stitch at the beginning. The whole thing will frazzle out.
Okay. So, yeah, it's not perfectly straight. And I definitely need to figure out how to tie this off. Because I forgot to backstitch it. Maybe, can I just tie it? Can I tie this in a knot? Does that work? If I just tie this, will I keep it from undoing? I bet it would. But let's see if it's straight. If this is in the way. This isn't even work. Is it straight? How's it look? If I put rows of those in, it'll look like upholstery. It might be straight enough. I'm not going to win any awards, but hey, I think it's going to work. Well, this is what I got done. I got them stitched into some sections. Um, some of them I did double, but as I was doing the last one, um, you can see maybe right here where things fizzled out. So I got a problem. I'm trying to figure out what the problem is, but uh, it's almost, almost ready to be the, the seat back. So it ought to look kind of cool. Um, looks like it's kind of shrunk up, but I think it's all those curves. When we pull it out tight, it might still be big enough. So, hoping for the best on that. And hoping for the best on that, where I struggled. So, going to have to do some research, figure out what's going on, why it doesn't quite, why it doesn't quite sew. It just kind of quit sewing after I put a fresh bobbin in. So, then I redid a bobbin and I still have trouble. So, I guess we'll see from next time. I've never done this before. <laughs> Lucy. Show it. But How did we do? Let's see if we can turn it around. Our problem is that your headlamp is like blowing this out. So if you could turn it off. Let's see. I can't back up. So. I don't know. 
looks like amateur upholstery. But hey, I think that'll work.